Hey, what's up everyone? Cameron here. All right, a lot of car manufacturers are rolling out Apple CarPlay into a lot of their vehicles. And I've never really shown Apple CarPlay in any of my car reviews just yet. And I'm just gonna do a little tour of Apple CarPlay. And I have my handy dandy iPhone right here. And then I also do have my handy dandy uh, USB cord. We are in a 2017 Kia Sorento SX equipped with the Kia UFO infotainment system and it comes with the Apple CarPlay and Android Auto and let's get started I'm going to show you guys Apple CarPlay Now, Apple CarPlay can be a little bit different in some vehicles, but in our particular Kia here, um, the first thing you want to do is plug in the USB cord into the main USB port in the vehicle, and then you'll want to plug it into your iPhone, of course. This is how it runs Apple CarPlay. It doesn't run it through Bluetooth, unfortunately. So let me just plug this in. It's kind of hard doing it without two hands. Okay, so now that it's plugged in, the first thing you want to do is also, Apple CarPlay will also show up on the main menu on the Uvo infotainment system on this head unit. And then you'll want to press on phone right here. And then basically, it's kind of like your iPhone integrated on to the system, basically. And then you can also um, stream music on here, of course. And then you also do have your maps too. You have your phone right here. Who would you like to call? And then you also do have Siri as well. You can view recent calls. You have your contacts, integrated dial pad. Works just like an iPhone, <laughs> pretty cool. It also do does give you a little digital clock right there. Then you have your now playing. You also do have tune in radio that you can access from here if you have that installed onto your uh, iPhone. And then you have Spotify too. A lot of music apps will also integrate onto the system like TuneIn and Pandora and iHeartRadio, all the main ones. Then you have your maps. It's basically just like the regular maps on the iPhone. It's pretty cool. You can zoom in and out. You also do have live traffic. All that good stuff. And it shows you your direction of travel. It's much easier to use than a regular navigation system, to be honest. Then you have your music. You can access your playlists, artists, albums. Pretty cool. But basically what it is, is your iPhone integrated on to the head unit. Then you have your text messages. To whom should I send your message? But what I really do love is that you can use Siri too, which is nice. And all you have to do is uh, press your voice recognition button. And it'll be pretty much the same in all vehicles. But when you have the Apple CarPlay hooked up, you can't use the regular Kia Uvo voice recognition. So it blocks that out. And then also you'll want to make sure that you update um, your iPhone regularly to the latest iOS version. But yeah, that's the Apple CarPlay system. I really do love the Apple CarPlay. If you're looking to buy a new vehicle, I'll, I certainly recommend getting it because it's a very useful and innovative feature.